Welcome everybody. Our paper title A New Boundary Element Formulation and Analysis of Fractional Order 3 Temperature Nonlinear Generalized Thermoelastic Problems of Functionally Graded Magnetic Thermoelectric Materials. The main aim of this article is to introduce a new fractional order theory to contribute for increasing development of technological and industrial applications of functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials. This theory called three temperature nonlinear generalized thermoelasticity of functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials. In order to guide the current research field to the development of new functionally graded materials, we should successfully implement the computerized numerical method that will be solved to and simulate difficult nonlinear functionally graded material problems. The governing equations of the proposed theory are very complex to solve experimentally or analytically because of very strong nonlinearity. To overcome this, we need to develop new numerical techniques for solving such equations. Therefore, we propose a new boundary element method formulation for solving the theory's governing equations. Due to the advantage of the boundary element method solution, such as treating problems with complex shapes that are difficult to treat with traditional methods and doesn't require the discretization of the interior domain. Also, it requires low CPU and low memory storage. Therefore, the boundary element method is suitable for treating a wide range of advanced functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials applications. The numerical results are presented highlighting the effects of the effects of magnetic field and degraded parameter on the thermal stress. The numerical results also confirm the validity and accuracy of the proposed technique. Formulation of the problem, the governing equations for fractional order nonlinear generalized thermoelastic problems of functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials can be written as equation 1, equation 2, 3, and 4. The fractional three temperature radiative heat conduction equations can be expressed as equation 5 with equation 6 and 7. The total energy of the unit mass can be described as an equation 8. Boundary element method simulation for temperature. Equation 13, which can be written in the absence of internal heat source as equation 14. To transform the domain integral in 14 to boundary, we assume that the time derivative of temperature can be approximated with a series of known function and unknown coefficients. Equation 15 and 16. Thus, equation 14 results in the following boundary integral equation 17, where equation 18 and 19, in which the entries are coefficients of, as in reference 34, using the standard boundary element discretization scheme for equation 17 and using equation 19, we obtain the following set of ordinary differential equation 21. 21 is a system of differential, ordinary differential equation. The diffusion matrix can be defined as an equation 22 with equations 23 and 24. In order to solve equation 21, numerically the function t, alpha, and q are interpolated as equation 25 and 26, where the parameter theta determines the practical time in the present time step. By differentiation equation 25 with respect to time, we get, the, uh, we get equation 27. By substituting from equations 25, 26, and 27 into equation 21, we obtain 28. Making use of initial conditions and boundary conditions at delta t and considering the previous time step solution as initial values for the next step. We obtain the following system of linear algebraic equations 29. BM simulation for displacement field. The governing equations 1 and 2 
using the weighted residual method can be transformed equivalently into the following integral equations 30 in which 31 the boundary conditions are 32 of 33 the integration of the first term of equations 33 and 34 leads to according to Huang and Liang 41 reference we can write the boundary integral equations 35 the integration of the left hand side of 35 by parts leads to equation 36 according to a ring the, elastic, the elastic stress can be written as equation 37 hence equation 36 may be expressed as equation 38 by applying the integration by parts again to the left hand side of 38 we obtain equation 39 the weighting functions for u equal delta n and vi equal 0 may be written as follows equation 40 according to dragos the fundamental solution may be expressed at in equation 41 the weighting function for u i and the vi delta can may be expressed as follows equation 42 on the basis of dragos the fundamental solution may be expressed as in equation 43 using the above two sets of weighting functions and to 39 we have Equations 44 and 45. Equation 46, uh, where uh, now we introduce the following relations. It's 47, by discretizing the boundary, we can write 46 in the following as in equation 48. By employing the following formula, equation 50, we can write equation 49 as in equation. 51. The global matrix system equation for all I nodes can be written as equation 52, where Q denotes displacement and B denotes attractions. Now we can write 52 into the following form 53. Geometry of the current problem. Boundary element model of the current problem. X3 showed variation of the thermal stress sigma 1 1 along the x axis for different values of fractional order parameter. It's for fractional order parameters 0 0.3, 0 0.6, 0 0.9. Variation of thermal stress with fractional order parameter. This thermal stress. Sigma 1, 2 for different values of fractional order parameter 0 0.3, 0 0.6, and 0 0.9. A, 0 0.3, 0 0.6, 0 0.9. Variation of the same asterisk sigma 2, 2 along the x axis for different values of fractional order parameter. Variation of the thermal stress sigma 1 1 for different values of functionally graded parameter m 0 0.3, 0 0.6, 0 0.9. Also, variation of the thermal stress sigma 1 2 along the x axis for different values of functionally graded parameter and variation of the thermal stress sigma 2 2 along the x axis for different values of functionally graded parameter as in fig 8. In order to validate or, or, or verify our results with a suggested method, we compare our results for a special case with finite element results and normal mode method. We get uh, good agreement with other results for boundary element method.
also sigma 1 1 for different methods BM, FBM, MMM, where fractional order equal 0 and functional graded 0 0.6. The primary goal of this paper is to present a novel fractional order theory that will aid in the advancement of technological and the industrial uses of functionally graded material, functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials. Three temperature nonlinear generalized thermoelasticity of functionally graded magnetic thermoelectric materials is the same given to this theory. We must successfully adopt computerized numerical methods for solving and simulating complex nonlinear functionally graded material problems in order to guide the current research field toward the development of new functionally graded materials. Because of its severe nonlinearity, the suggested theories governing equations are extremely difficult to solve experimentally or analytically. To solve this, new numerical approaches for solving such equations must be developed. As a result, we suggest a new formulation of the boundary element method for solving theories governing equation because of this benefits of boundary element method approach such as ability to solve complicated shapes problems that are difficult to deal using standard methods and the lack of the need for discretization of the internal domain. It also necessitates of add low CPU utilization and memory strike. As a result, the boundary element is appropriate for addressing a wide range of sophisticated applications. The numerical results are presented emphasizing the impact of magnetic field and the graded parameter on thermal strength and functionally graded. The numerical findings also validate the proposed formulation and the solution techniques and validity and accuracy. Mini thanks, mini mini thanks.